up guys coming at you from the kitchen restaurant hard rock hotel orlando florida here with molly schuyler and the killer kennedy we're about to take on the kitchen sink challenge burger fries big old piece of cake and ice cream like massive cake seven layers <laughs> that's crazy so we're gonna get in here and check this thing out and I'll catch you guys with some food we're inside the kitchen here at the Hard Rock Hotel and uh, they brought the challenges out to us you got this big burger here you got some, you got some french fries and then you have this, this big bad mamma jamma look at that thing holy that's probably how crazy that's that what I'm for Massive. Look at this thing. That thing is ridiculous. I don't know if it's the plate that's heavy or it's honestly the cake, but the cake is like, it's this behemoth. I think it's the cake. Oh, it's... So they gave, they gave us 30 minutes to finish this thing. They said if we finished it and we were still hungry, they'd give us another challenge, so maybe. Just maybe we'll do too. Are you guys ready? Absolutely. Alright. Here we go. Three, two, one. Kitchen sink challenge here at the Hard Rock. Fried pickle. Fried pickle. I'm hot fried pickle. Ow! That good? I like a burger. I feel like that cake is going to be way worse than what we all think it is. I see small children eyeing up my cake, but it's my cake. Huh. My cake. They got one. Okay. They got one. They got cake over there. They have to there. share it though. They have that is a very good burger. What about that? What do you think about that? Gross. Mushrooms, mushrooms on there. This is a good burger. Very good burger. I definitely want the best burger I've had in a while. I think this food is stacked with onion rings. Good. It's hard. So this was one of the only food challenge places that actually cooked the burger the way that I ordered it, which was surprising. Um, most of the time you run into like way overcooked, so I, I normally order like medium or medium rare as far as burgers go. Most of the time it's medium, uh, more so medium rare on steaks. But uh, so that was nice going into this, that the burger is actually prepared how I wanted it to be. Oh, I'm so excited. Look how big this is. It's Look at massive. this behemoth. We turn to the side, it's like... It's bigger than my head. This thing is ridiculous.
Comment below how many calories you think this slice of pie has. Left. That, that one was the best sugar thing I've ever eaten. Yeah, this cake is so dense and so good. I'd say that this has to rank in the top of like, I can't. 10 food this one layer, I can't down. break through the bottom. Is it just... Cookie dough? Oh, cookie. I feel like I'm stabbing this cake right. I want to feel like it's just gonna like suddenly go through and I'm gonna break this place. You, you know what? It's very. Uh... Oh my dear god. This is. I think the only thing it needs is a layer of carrot cake. like pecan pie for living.
it's really hard to use these. The bottom's a brownie, then there's like a pe like cookie dough. This is pecan pie. There's cheesecake. I think chocolate cake and white cake. The whole bag is covered with frosting and chocolate chips. It's so good. This piece right here is left. It's probably a pound. Over a pound. A piece of this cake might be you know, $40. Huh? Oh, absolutely. So A piece of this cake is absolutely worth 20 bucks. Alright, we're coming up on the end of the video now. Now, uh, you will notice at the very end there's about a 30 second gap in the time on the clock. And that is because the camera actually turned off. Uh, we didn't notice it until you know, 30 seconds had passed. So sorry about that. But um, this challenge here definitely rates in the top 10 of the tastiest food challenges that I've ever done. That cake was delicious. It was very dense though. The bottom two layers were uh, actually like a fudge brownie type deal and uh, cookie dough. They were just, they were chilled so they were rock hard. Uh, still definitely very delicious though. If you're ever around this area of Orlando, definitely make sure that you stop in and check this place out. I think that they were selling the cake for $20 a slice, which is actually a pretty good deal. That's a fair sized chunk of cake. Um, even if you would split it between like seven people give everybody a different layer. But I will let you get back to the rest of the video. I fucking read here. My bottom layer is like brick. That was the best ever. How many calories?
calories do you think is in that slice of cake? 6,000? You did a good job. <laughs> At least. Oh my god, I almost failed this. I literally almost failed this one. It is so brick hard that you can't chew it. Like, I'm sitting here like trying to chisel apart with a knife, and I'm like, I can't bite it. Oh my god. Wow. Yeah, if the cake was warm, it'd be easy, but at the end, it's chilled, and they hard to eat. <laughs> wow. Thank you for being the weakest link with me, <laughs> because I really feel that we. We bonded over this. <laughs> that was the kitchen sink. That was delicious. Burger was great. Fries were good. Delicious cake. I got to the bottom layers there. They were just the, bottom, the very bottom layer is like fudge, solid fudge. That was a tough one. But the layer right above that, the cookie layer, it was just solid. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Make sure to check their channels out as well. Links in my description. If you're ever in Orlando, stop in. Get yourself a piece of this cake. Catch you guys on the next one.